everyone. I'm Catherine Herridge reporting from CBS News in Washington. Thanks for joining us. Here's a look at the top stories we're tracking right now. From world leaders to movie stars, millions across the globe are mourning the death of Britain's Queen Elizabeth II. We'll speak with our team of correspondents on the ground in London. The King's speech, King Charles III delivers his first address to the UK. We'll break down his remarks and how he plans to shape the future of the royal family and monarchy. Operation London Bridge is in full swing. That's the code name of the British government's highly detailed plan to memorialize the world's longest serving monarch. What to expect in the days ahead. And later this hour, former President Donald Trump's legal team has until Monday to respond to the Justice Department's appeal of a special master for the Mar-a-Lago search, what the new government filings reveal about the criminal investigation. Plus, we hear exclusively from one of the nation's most respected and experienced special masters, lawyer Kenneth Feinberg, who told us the job may be impossible to fill and any candidate will face political backlash. But first, the world continues to mourn the loss of Queen Elizabeth II. Thousands gathered outside Buckingham Palace in the last 24 hours, bringing flowers and personal notes. 